In the last two years, all around that local council development area has continued to impact the lives of residents through its several developmental projects, evident in all its political words. To boost health care delivery, the authorities of Olorunda LCD commissions Mushin Eshepe and Obele Primary Health Center, which will serve 13 communities. Present at the commissioning were council officials, health personnel, members of the management team and residents. In his speech, the council chairman, Samson Olatunde, said governance is about the people, assuring that the dividends of democracy will continue to get to the grassroots. We in Olorun Da SDA, we discovered that health is wealth, and health is very, very essential. As long as there is health, everything is possible. That is why we need to to ensure that we build health centers in various places. We discovered that these things are they, they, they used to go very far for health treatment. As far as we are other centers and general people. And based on the fact that the road is not assist, that is why we discovered that we have to pick a center with their dog step. Today is a joyful day that we will have first projects in our dog domain. I want us to take care of this property. It is for us. It is good for our use and to ensure that we adequately take good care of the facility. Do your God and for the use of man, the name of God the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Health officials express satisfaction over the edifice with an assurance of prompt service delivery. I really want to thank the country chairman, Honorable Samson, on that one day for long sure. Because this place has been abandoned for the past 25 years. And none of the none of the people the government has come to do it. That is the reason why I need to thank the country chairman of the for long show for in the own period of administration to look into this community and build a sort of thing like the health center in Obelia Sekwe. We are assuring the community that myself and my colleagues we are going to discharge our duty to the best of our knowledge. And anybody that comes here, be it uh, ANC, pregnant woman, or nursing mothers for immunization, we are going to try our best to give them the best. The chairman in an interview disclosed that the facility is aimed at tackling the difficulties people face in accessing quality health care, adding that more PHC would be commissioned soon. Is that they should only maintain the facility, keep it very well, understand, and come. They should always come for their health here. Whenever they have health challenges, they should come here and, that, and ensure the facility is well kept. In a related development, the council leadership also commissioned an ultra-modern market and an area office in the Morogbo town. The chairman said that the new area office and markets will help the council to improve on its internally generated revenue, thereby enhancing more development in the area. That project is not mainly for the people in this environment. It's for the people in Nolonda, and not only in Nolonda, people in Badagri and also Ogun State and the other side of the road like Janikin, uh, like that, like that. Because it's a, it's a modern market, it's also an international standard. That is why it's named before our father and our leader, Shwajwala Ahmed Tunubu, 
So the route that market is to is to take care of so many areas, and it's a big market for that matter. The Yaloja General Falashade Tinubu Oju appraised the performance of Falorunda LCD while appealing to traders to take ownership of the edifice. And uh, personally, I want to appreciate the executive chairman of uh, Olorunda SCDA uh, for the wonderful job he has done. We appreciate the developer for good job and uh, the entire traders of Morogbo markets. Uh, we say thank. I say thank you to them for the patience. This is a uh, long overdue, but this is the day that the Lord has set aside for this program and the commissioning. We bless his name for it. Uh, this is a good, uh, brilliant work that the chairman has done. Whoever provides markets in the community is uh, developing economy of the said community and the entire nation. It is very important that we have uh, markets, a good one like this around us. So that I want to enjoy the, all the traders, especially those that trade on the streets, to come in here and get uh, space. I'm highly delighted for what the chairman has done because this is first of its kind. Like um, from other experiences I've had before coming to Colorado NCD, this is one of the best area office I've ever seen. And I'm happy that I'm, I'm the first area officer to use this office. And I promise that we are going to make use of this place to the best of the chairman's expectations and we promise that we are going to be proactive on our job. The project are expected to boost economic activities and enhance the growth of the council area. The market is one of the best now in this local government. We don't have a structure like that in this local government. All the ones that we have is a local one. This very one they built and they commissioned today, uh, we are so happy about it. And uh, it's a big edifice that everybody can testify. All the facilities are also there. So we thank the local government chairman and the developer for what they did. We God continue to bless them. It's a laudable project that uh, gave a lot of relief for people of Borugua and its environment. Yes, you can see that most of the things that took them to that take them to far away in the Woro has now been brought very closer to them. So it's a laudable program and I'm very proud to have it here. And we also understand that um, for them to work efficiently, to have proper utilization of this world, it is necessary that their welfare is well taken care of. So building a more decent complex, a more decent office for them to be able to carry out their functions and duties became imperative for us to do because this administration really, really um, um, prioritizes the welfare of the people as much as the welfare of the staff of the council. So in trying to better the welfare of our staff came the dream of putting up this structure and we give God the glory that um, after conception of the dream we were able to exhibit it and harness it and it's become reality today.